Hey everyone, this is Jess from non Techie Entrepreneur and this tutorial is a part of the Mastering Shopify series. In this video, I will cover how to customize your Shopify checkout page. One of the most overlooked places when getting your shop ready for customers is the actual checkout page. This is the page your customers complete their purchase on. So we want to make sure that it is branded to our brand. So there are two ways to get to the Shopify checkout. You can go to online store and themes and click customize on your live theme. And then up top, you'll be able to select the checkout page. And this is what our checkout page currently looks like. As you see, it's very bland, no colors at all, no logo. So you're able to add a background image to your banner, which is about the here. So when you add that banner background image, then you can add your logo. For this, I'm just going to use a placeholder just to show you how it looks. You can set that logo to be left, center, or right, and small, medium, or large. Then you are able to customize the main content area. The main content area is here on the left-hand side with the customer's contact and billing information. You don't have to change how that looks, and if you wanted to change the color, you can do that here. And it updates for you so you're able to go ahead and see how it's going to look before saving it. So then we have our order summary background image which is on this side that shows our product, our discount code, and our total. You can also change the background color of this too. Now on the checkout page, when you set up your typography in the customized section of this theme, the types do not translate over to the checkout. You have to choose from this list to be able to have it, the fonts updated here. And they're mostly web safe fonts, so it's not many to choose from, but I like to choose one that's closest to my brand. Then you can add your colors in which would be your accent colors. Then you have your buttons that you can update the color to and then errors. So from there, the accent, we see the links are the color that I have specified here. And that's it. Those are your checkout settings that you are able to go in and update. So if this tutorial helped, please like this video and subscribe to my channel for more videos on Shopify.